Well, I've been tagged. I was tagged by the big boss man. At least that's what I call him, the boss man. Luxury fragrance boss tagged me in four for life for every season. Let me tell you, it's tough, even with my new collection. But if you want to find out which ones, stay right there. Welcome back everyone, Joe from NYC Fragrances and I got put into a tag video, little old me. Anyway, it's the fall for life for every season, I got tagged by the Luxury Fragrance Boss, one of my channels that I like to watch very often, his content's really good, you should definitely go check him out. So, my new collection, relatively new collection, I started collecting eight months ago, so what four fragrances would I keep for the rest of my life for each season well the first one is from the house of Zerzhov and that is 1861 Renaissance this one is a beautiful citrus beautiful floral just captivated me from the time I got a sample of it it is just perfect spring fragrance in my opinion I had my top 10 niche list and it was in the top 10. It wasn't my number one. And the reason I'm picking this one for my spring fragrance is it just has something to it that for me is more heavy citrus. Whereas my number one for spring wasn't strictly citrus, but I wanted a nice fresh citrus fragrance to be my number one or my all-time favorite for spring. My summer fragrance comes from a house that I really enjoy as well. And that is from the house of Mansara. And it is Mansara, Sicily. This is just a beautiful fragrance as well. Opens up with this strong peach note beautiful florals on the dry down it's just transforms throughout the wearing to me I just when, when I think summer this is my fragrance I don't think of anything else at least not yet my collection like I said I'm relatively new to collecting so for me it's all about this fragrance for the summer Mansara Sicily my summer for life fragrance so now we get to my favorite season my favorite season is fall my choice for fall fragrance it was one of my first niche fragrances I got my nose on it is my favorite from this house if anyone knows me or has spoken to me and knows what my favorite is from the house of Creed they'll know that it is Royal Oud Creed Royal Oud this one there's no Oud I don't get oud at all. I get this beautiful woody sandalwood spiciness. It is just a fragrance that I feel royal when I put it on. Uh, I wear it. I've worn it a few times at night. It's one of the fragrances that I have had a chance to rewear a few times. With all the testing I do, I don't get to ch uh, try all the fragrances that I have. I don't get to wear all the fragrances that I have. I'm mostly going through a lot of samples and a lot of decants, but I do reach for royal oud on nights because I just like wearing it and I like it for special occasions. I also even layer it with Creed Aventus which makes for a beautiful combination as well. But my fall fragrance for life is Creed's Royal Oud. Now the last season, winter, when it's nice and chill, you want something cozy and comforting. This one, yeah, I could see you being cozy with it, getting very comforting, comfort, comfortable wearing it. But for me, it's just, the denseness of it, how powerful it is. It's just a strong, beautiful, spicy amber fragrance that I truly enjoy wearing. I just got it recently, it is just that good. And it's from a house that I'm slowly discovering now and I've come to love their fragrances. And they're a new house, but they're hitting the market with some really good fragrances and there are more fragrances to come. And that house is Mosque Milano. 
and the fragrance I'm talking about for my winter for life is Tango. Like I said, amber, amber, amber. This one, this is hysterical. I just go to my cabinet, which is right behind me. I pop the cap on this one, just like I just did. Take a whiff and put it right back in the cabinet. I do it frequently. I just love this fragrance. There's nothing I could really, really say about it other than I just love it. And that's why it's my winter fragrance for life. And please, Mas Milano, don't stop making this fragrance. And please don't reformulate it. I just love the way it is as it is. Please, please, please don't change it. So, in keeping the tradition going forward, I have to tag someone to keep it going. So I like to tag one of my fellow fragrance friends locally. Actually, they're both local dudes. The first one is Christian from One Accord Fragrance Reviews. And the second, I want to see what he's got to say, what his four for life are. I want to see it done in his style because I'm sure it's going to be very entertaining. And that is the one and the only Cubano. So, let me know what you think of these four fragrances that I picked in the comments below. Let me know what your choices are for the four for life by season. And as always, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And remember, if you smell good, you feel good. Have a nice day.